Hello, so this video is about emotional relationship roller coaster. When your relationship is an emotional roller coaster, it tends to have lots of highs and lows, often in rapid succession. One day you're arguing intensely, the next day you're feeling really happy and close. You may find it hard to predict what things are going to be like on any given day, or when they might swing from one state to the other. So, how does this kind of relationship develop? The most common reason for this kind of relationship developing is one or more partners finding it difficult to manage their emotions and how they express them to their partners. They may get easily upset or veer rapidly into different emotional states. The reason behind this can be complex, but sometimes have their roots in how the person learned to relate to other people when growing up. They may, for instance, have had an unstable relationship with their parents, and as a result, find themselves attempting to recreate this environment as an adult because it's what they're most used to. Although it sounds counterintuitive, familiarity is a significant principle in emotional relationships, even in situations where the familiarity isn't necessarily productive or easy to bear. In fact, research has shown that often we are attracted to what is familiar to us, and being exposed to certain types of people can increase our attraction to them. This is essentially subconscious, and as such, we're unlikely to be aware of it. Um, how will the roller coaster affect you? It requires significant levels of energy to maintain this type of relationship, to the extent where it can be difficult to concentrate on other areas of your life properly. Dealing with negative emotions is challenging. Excuse me. And switching between highs and lows in rapid succession can be exhausting. It can produce a sense of uncertainty, derived from not knowing where you stand on any given day. People in this kind of relationship often describe themselves as consumed by it, saying that it becomes the center of their lives. So how to deal with it? An ideal outcome for someone in a ro relationship roller coaster. Maybe for them to retain a lot of the passion while finding a way to regulate the characteristics of um, highs and lows. Better understanding is usually the first step towards meaningful change. Finding out how you fit together emotionally, what your expected needs are, and what changes you would like to make are the key to ensuring that each partner can be heard within the relationship. This often means asking yourself and each other really honest and occasionally challenging questions. Listening to each other, perhaps with the help of a counselor, can often mean that each partner gets a fuller understanding of how their partners, their patterns of communication may be affecting their partner. By becoming more aware of these relationship patterns, you can understand how the attraction between you really works. Developing more awareness about things like this will in turn help to develop new patterns that are helpful for both partners. And that's it for this video. Thanks for listening.